it is clear that the prime minister is afraid of speaking inside parliament he is scared to debate the issue inside parliament if you look at the actions of the bjp inside the parliament over the last few days it is clear that the prime minister is afraid of speaking inside parliament he is scared to debate the issue inside parliament we have heard the ministers of the ruling party saying that they are ready for a discussion we have said we are ready for a discussion the only person who has not said anything inside parliament the only person who has not been seen inside the parliament is the honorable prime minister of india so it is absolutely clear that the prime minister has no intention of raising the issue of manipur inside the parliament now what could that reason be he will only know better is it because of the gross mismanagement of his central government and the state government is it the guilt that he has failed the people of manipur or is it that he simply has no answers as to why he is allowing the chief minister of manipur n biren singh to continue in his position he has absolutely no answers and that's why as shakti singh ji said at the beginning of parliament he said a few words to the media outside the parliament and that's it he has no more to say why is the prime minister so unwilling so afraid to speak inside the parliament he can go to the us and address a joint session of american policy makers in the us congress or their version of parliament but he cannot speak inside our nation's parliament he can go to france and hug macron but he cannot go to manipur and hug the victims of rape hug the victims who have lost a family member i would like to bring to the notice of all our citizens the honorable home minister of india shri amit shah ji today in lok sabha appealed to all members of the opposition to initiate a discussion a debate on the issue afflicting the state of manipur amit shah ji has repeatedly said that in both houses of parliament he as minister in charge of home affairs would like to bring certain facts to light that the discussion is important from a perspective of national security internal security that this discussion this debate is also expected by citizens of our country who elect us to parliament so that issues of national importance can be productively discussed what is shocking is the insistence of the opposition parties to not allow facts to come to the fore congress party apne aap ko selective outrage tak simit karna chahti hai 
ये राजनीति उनकी पूरा राष्ट्र समझता है लेकिन विषय मणिपुर का जहां तक है ये आंतरिक सुरक्षा से संबंधित है राष्ट्रीय सुरक्षा से संबंधित है जब देश के गृह मंत्री जो इस मंत्रालय के अंतर्गत उस विषय पर संविधानिक जिम्मेदारी रखते हैं स्वयं सामने से कह रहे हैं आइए चर्चा कीजिए तो मणिपुर की हिंसा का ऐसा वो कौन सा तथ्य है जो कांग्रेस पार्टी छुपाना चाहती है What the changes in India's population and the differential growth rate rationales about why it's not ending? What's your rationale? We have a very special the guest show, on the record. The interview. The role that the uh, U.S. side played at that point of time. Puri dunia ki nazar. Zoom, my phone is tapped. I can probably say hello to Mr. Modi. Aapke Bharat par hai. Pakistan has a unique negotiating the style. Rising confidence of India under Prime Minister Narendra Modi. Communist China is the greatest threat. There will come a day that we will see far more radical extremist. I'm uh, I'm still a little perplexed by why we Your daily dose of news from India and across the world. Cutting edge views and analysis. Tune into HD videos, click on the bell icon to subscribe.